Amanda, welcome to my favorites and my hateds for the month of August. I only have a few this month and I really had to sit there and think about it. I wanted there to be a whole bunch, but sometimes there just isn't a whole bunch. But, so I'm just going to go ahead and make this short and sweet and tell you what my favorites are this month. And I'm going to talk about the MAC Burgundy Times 9 palette. And this shade right here is called Antiqued. I absolutely love this shade. I have to say this one right here is my favorite. It's what I have on my lid today and it's just, I, I absolutely love it. And this right here is called Poppy Seed and I love it as well. It's perfect for a transition shade and also whenever I use the Estee Edit liner in my waterline, I take the edges of it and I use this shade right here which is perfect to just blend it out. So I love those. However, the ones that I don't like that I absolutely hate is this one right here is Honey Lust and that's because I have to use it wet and really have to pack it on to make it work for me and I don't know if you could tell but this gets hard pan all the time. It's this shade in particular and this one right here. I don't like this one either but all the other shades are just fine. So that is that. And then my last item that I absolutely love is this jojoba oil. I got this at TJ Maxx a while ago for $5.99. This is really great. This has changed my pressing powder life. I know a lot of people talk about using different oils and I just used alcohol, but you just use alcohol and a couple drops of this and I know that it saved my Mac soft and gentle. So I'm really happy and I highly recommend if you guys are a project panner, definitely go ahead and get this. It'll help you with pressing of things and stuff. Now, my worst product ever has got to be this right here. This is the Bella Pierre Lip Liner in Cinnamon. And quite honestly, this just sucks. This just sucks. Not only did the bottom come off right here, it's really hard to sharpen and again it's one of those things that just uh, whenever you go ahead and use it not as it's not as bad as the real her one but sometimes it'll um little chunks will break off and probably about once a week or so it'll just complete once or twice a week i should say it'll just completely just break off and then you have to resharpen it so i don't recommend these i mean this is 18 dollars why is this $18? This is crap. I would rather buy some kind of drugstore eyeliner like Rimmel. Rimmel makes amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. So, and that has never broke on me before. So, yeah, this is definitely the worst products that I've used in a while. So, but then again, I hate all lip liners, but I know when something is good or bad, maybe I just haven't found the right lip liner for me, but I just know that that one definitely isn't it. So that is sort of my short and sweet favorites and hate for the month of August. Let me know in the comments below what your favorites are and what you are absolutely despising right now. So I know to stay away. I hope that you guys have a wonderful day. Make sure you go ahead and give this a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!